Okay, I realized I've <clears throat> forgotten to leave you with a little problem. So here is one where you can put into action what we were just learning about the type 1a supernova. So here's some uh, real data, real light curve uh, from uh, one of these big surveys that's going on looking for uh, supernovae everywhere called the Palomar Transit Factory. So it's actually using the original uh, big Palomar telescope that was the biggest one in the world at the beginning of the 1900s. Um, it's been reinvigorated to, uh, to carry out this kind of work. So you've got the apparent magnitude here, so uh, on this scale, and you've got the absolute magnitude rather conveniently for you uh, on this scale. Okay, so they've already put that on there for you. Uh, so again, ignore extinction and work out how far away uh, this uh, supernova is. So you're looking at uh, trying to work out the, uh, the brightness, both apparent and absolute, at the, the peak here. Okay, I'll leave you with that one.